It's little known fact that up to one in three PhD students never finish their degree. That's because the PhD is an emotional roller coaster, and how well students react to these emotional pressures is crucial to their success. In this course, we'll explore how the pressures of the PhD process can trigger certain emotions more than others, especially boredom, loneliness and frustration. We'll look at how curiosity can be a boon and a curse for scholars, and why students who do a PhD, probably the most smartest students among us, often don't feel very confident. We'll look at how some confusion can be a good thing, but too much is a problem, and the many and splendid dimensions of love. I'm Inga Mewburn, Director of Research Training here at the Australian National University, and the founder and managing editor of the Thesis Whisperer blog. I've been working with PhD students for nearly 10 years and they never cease to amaze me. I write about their emotions on the blog and they write many thousands of comments in return. Of course you have to be smart to finish a PhD, but you also have to be emotionally resilient, which is why I'm so excited about this MOOC. PhD students are misunderstood and misrepresented, particularly in the media. In films you'll see them as a brilliant but emotionally stunted individual. This is far from the truth. Students are going through a stressful but exciting time in their lives. I want these emotions to be recognised, understood and celebrated for what they are. This course will be interesting to you if you're a research student right now or considering becoming one in the future. It will also be interesting to the academic advisors and supervisors of research students who are studying right now. Or you might be the family member of a PhD student. They might be your son, your daughter, your brother, your sister or your partner and you might want to understand what they're going through. This MOOC will help us create a better and more supportive academic environment where students can do their best work. I'm looking forward to talking with you in this course and on social media, so join me for this journey into the emotional life of the research student.